Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with a, another clothing haul. I've collected these clothes for the past few months and also keep in mind that I am not into summer clothes whatsoever. So the clothes I'm going to show you guys aren't really summery but my definition of summer. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this video and if you want to see more videos of mine, make sure to click the subscribe button down below and give this video a thumbs up for more haul videos because I love filming these and without further ado let's just get started okay so the first item that I'm going to be showing you guys is actually a scarf and you're probably thinking why the heck are you wearing a scarf in the summertime like are you honestly insane probably am but this scarf is seriously so so light like you can honestly wear this in the summertime and you won't get hot I wouldn't wear this during the daytime just because it is like 40 degrees outside more so during the nighttime when it gets like a little chillier and you want like a jacket but you don't want to bring a jacket so you just bring a scarf which is way lighter and you can wrap it yourself around it like a shawl or you can just wear it like this and there's so many different ways you can wear it I actually showed this in my January haul if you watch that I mentioned this brand and I just absolutely love it it is from Mooncats and it is like my favorite scarf that you can find for cashmere and I wore my black one all the time during the winter time and now I'm going to be wearing this all the time during the summer the quality is amazing it's super soft moving on I went to Topshop and I finally found culottes I have been on a hunt to find culottes for the longest time and I've tried so many different pairs on but all of them were too long on me because I am very short so I found this one from Topshop and it's the perfect length and also I love how like the stripes are going down vertically so it elongates my legs and it's just perfect like I love it the only thing is that it is very itchy like the quality isn't really that great the next place I went to is honey I was walking by and I saw this choker on the mannequin and I absolutely fell in love with it and it is this one it's so beautiful it's by the brand wildflower and you may have seen celebrities wearing something like this but it's actually the Fallon jewelry that costs $300 and I wasn't about to spend $300 more so $400, $500 Canadian I found this alternative and it cost me $35 then I picked up this suede choker as well which is basically a long piece of suede string so I forgot to show this in my last thrift top but I decided to show you guys it now because I just absolutely love it and it is a, another denim piece this one is different because the sleeves are flared and the bottom is like all ripped and I just seriously just love this it's so different it's just so cool I may add like some patches to it like the back or like just do something so like if you guys have like any suggestions on what I should do with this jacket please leave it in the comments below I went to the bay and I found this Theory dress on sale and Theory has become one of my favorite brands because their clothes are so minimalistic and just very classic looking and I just absolutely love it and just it's just very me so I picked this up and it's just so gorgeous it's like very structured looking then I found this knitted dress from Rangbone and can throw on a leather jacket or a denim jacket next I went to the store called Dimage and it is also part of the bay I believe that's how you pronounce it because my French is not that good I picked up this bomber jacket and when I saw it I thought it was going to be at least like $900, $800 but it's kind of a little less than that and it's still pretty pricey but honestly I'm going to be wearing this so much like you have no idea how much use I will get out of it it's this beautiful cobalt blue color and it has like a cactus on like the side and it's just so so gorgeous and this just also gets me really excited to wear more color the next place i went to is Saks Fifth avenue and as you can tell from this haul video a lot of the things i picked up are more luxurious and designer pieces just because i feel like 
I'm really opting out of like the whole fast fashion. So like I decided to buy things that are either from like the thrift store or like designer items. However, I'm not going to spend like a thousand dollar on like Yves Saint Laurent jeans because that's just a little insane and I don't have that kind of money. So if you guys want to see a video on how you can find designer pieces at an affordable price, then let me know in the comments because I would totally love to do one of that. Or just me talking about fast fashion, just let me know. And okay, let's just get back into the video. I just wanted to make like a quick disclaimer. So I picked up this top and it is from Rag & Bone as well. And as you can tell, Rag & Bone is my favorite brand. It is so beautiful. Like I love how like the stripes are going down vertically, which is really nice because it makes you look taller. And then the last thing that I picked up from there is this t-shirt from Wild Fox, which says, magazines lovers and ice cream and i really like this for like lounging around and just for running errands and i forgot how soft their clothes are and then i went to Saks of fifth which is also part of Saks fifth avenue but it's like discounted designer clothes and i found these jeans from Current Elliot and these are the cropped straight ones. Like I'm just really over wearing skinny jeans for like the summertime just because it's gonna be really hot and I just got these ones which are like still jeans but they're like cropped and a bit more like flared out. And then I picked up these gold hoop earrings which I wouldn't normally buy but since they were on sale, I was like why not just play around with them because they're just so fun and also really cute on. Then I went to Hot Renfrew and I got another pair of jeans and these are also the cropped straight jeans but from Rag & Bone and they're just like cropped and I love like the bottom of it. And then I picked up these joggers which is so cute and the brand is DWP which means design with purpose and I just absolutely love these like I don't have any white joggers and these are also cropped as well and they're just so cute perfect for the summertime and the last item that I picked up from there is actually a bathing suit and it is from Parenza Schooler and it's a halter top bathing suit and it's so so beautiful I just love it the next thing that I picked up is the Kylie Jenner lip kits oh my gosh I'm so so happy so I just picked up two lip kits because they were so expensive like the most expensive lip products I've ever owned in my entire life and especially like shipping to Canada and everything oh my gosh most likely never going to purchase these again because of the price but other than that, they're really beautiful. I have Coco K on my lips right now. And I just, I really like it a lot. However, the only thing is that it is very drying. And I like scrub my lips and I put like lip balm on. But there's, you can see like the cracks like seeping through. I don't know. But I got the Coco K as well as Dolce K, which I didn't try yet. So the last two items that I picked up are shoes, and the first one that I found are mules, and I have been on a hunt for mules for the longest time, and I actually got one from Farfetch if you watch my Snapchat. Sadly, I had to return those because they were too big, but I'm actually glad that I returned those because they were also quite pricey. So I was searching around, and I basically found this store called The Real Wheel and it is a consignment store for designer items where they sell basically everything super cheap and I found these meals for a really good price like I'm so obsessed with it and it's funny how like things work out because those ones didn't fit and I found these ones which are for way less however the only thing is that you do have to pay customs and duties if you live in Canada, so that's the only thing. But other than that, really cute. It is by the brand Tibby. And the last item that I picked up are from Vans. And oh my gosh, like I remember wearing these in like middle school and stuff like that. But I got these high top shoes and these are the classic slim ones. 
yeah i just got these and they're really cute and definitely my go-to summer sneakers so that is basically everything that i got i hope you guys enjoyed it and if you did make sure to give it a thumbs up and click that subscribe button down below and as always all of the clothes will be listed in the description if you guys want to go check that i hope you guys all have a wonderful wonderful day or night depending on when you're watching this and i will see you guys in my next video bye